Now let's consider this. A water wave has a frequency of 6 hertz and a wavelength of 3 meters. A. What is the period of these waves? And B. What is the wave velocity? Let's list the information that's given. In this case, we're given that the frequency is 6 hertz. And we're also given that the wavelength is 3 meters. In the first question, it asks for the period realizing that period is time. In the second question, it's asking for the velocity. So first, let's consider the period of the wave. In your text, you can see the formula to determine period is 1 divided by the frequency. So very simply, we insert the frequency of 6 hertz, which is a vibration per second, and we simply divide 1 by 6. And two, a couple of significant figures, 0.17 unit would be seconds. If in fact we were true to the number of significant figures in this problem, we would round it to 0.2 seconds. Now let's consider the second question. So let's consider the formula speed equals wavelength times frequency. In this case, the wavelength is 3 meters, and essentially that's meters per vibration, times a frequency of 6 hertz, which is a vibration per second. Here you can see that the vibrations cancel. You're left with a unit of meters per second. If you did the math, that would be 18. And then rounding it to the proper number of significant figures, the speed would be 20 meters per second.